Good morning and welcome to Broadhead Cardinal Television. Today we will be meeting Blake Bagley and meeting a Spanish teacher. Let's see our first student. I'm Blake Bagley. Classman. It's nice not having, like knowing where you're going and everything. Sports. I'm in volleyball and softball. I eat PB and J's every day. <laughs> I really like English. Members, there will not be a full student council meeting tomorrow at 7.30. It will be Thursday morning at 7.30. That will be the full student council meeting. Tomorrow, um, all, committees meeting, or all committees need to meet at either 7.30 in the morning or during resource. Tomorrow morning, we'll be see you at the pool, so come join us. Um, the scholarship list is um, updated and in the guidance office. That's for all seniors. The date permission letters are due this Friday. Um, you can pick them up in the office or um, and then turn them in the, back into the office. Those are for homecoming date permission slips. Um, each, for the banner creating project, each grade level is asked to express their school spirit by designing a banner for homecoming. The student council will provide each grade with level with a sheet of butcher paper. The banner specifications have been given to each class representative. The designing may not be begin before Monday, September 22nd and cannot exceed Friday, September 26th after resource hour. You may work on your banner every day during resources in the auditorium. They may be stored in the of the board's room throughout the school day. They will be displayed throughout the school during homecoming week and shown during the parade. The football players will run through the winning banner on Friday night and the winning grade level will also be awarded spirit points. Today, voting for the homecoming court will take place during English classes. You should vote for five boys and five girls, not for six boys and six girls, like it says on the ballot. Tonight, cross country is at Bigfoot, volleyball is at Lloyd Turner, and the JV and freshman football team is home against McFarland. Good luck, Cardinals. half the students here take Spanish. Um, I think Senora Wichita and I both have close to 100 students each. Um, Spanish can be an easy class if you really pay attention and try hard. This year is going great. Last year Senora Wichita and I worked together really well and the students are all prepared and ready to move on. Everybody's learning a lot and things are going great. We have a trip coming up in the summer of 2016 to Puerto Rico. Any students who are interested in going should see me for information. Really sunny, low of 46, and then later on, high of 73. Patty, green beans, applesauce or pineapple, rice crisp pie treats, and a choice of milk. Tuesday. Thanks, Thanks for watching. watching.